Today on the Artist Studio, we review the artworks of Arabella Proffer. Yo, 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 what's good, everybody? Welcome back to the Artist Studio here at NFT Art Talk. We are so excited about today. Always, anytime we get to talk about or to Arabella Proffer, we are excited about it. Uh, we're going to be diving in to her, one of her, some of her new foundation stuff, some of the oh, new stuff yeah. she has on Tezos, uh, one of her collections, Fuzz Cats. We're really excited. We want to remind you before we get too far into the art, we did get the opportunity to sit down and talk to this amazing artist. Please Please don't forget to check out that interview really cool stuff we have even believe it or not featured some of her artwork on our show before here at the artist studio so make sure that you check out that episode it's really cool it kind of shows some other art this is a very very talented artist uh, that has done all sorts of different stuff so make sure to check out all the different styles not just what we're talking about today but let's get Cardiff back in here and let's talk about the art this is something that she just released definitely great artist Arabella real tight motion mentioned we did a long interview with her so check that out for sure love this piece that she came out with a uh, cat with uh, that looks like uh, astronaut actually I don't know what planet it's on but hopefully we get her on another interview and she kind of explore that and elaborate on it a little bit more but yeah love the colors on it love the floating crown actually uh love the little kitten just just hanging out with the tongue out there just chilling on whatever planet that is and whatever galaxy that is but really love the artwork and definitely just just vibing on it man honestly for real, the pretty pink planet with the pretty pink princess. Uh, I think this, this cat's name is Lil Bub. Uh, this artist is amazing. Uh, you can support her. We have no problem telling you to support her uh, at all. Uh, this this piece is 20 Tez. There's a couple of editions out. If you like cats, which who doesn't love adorable kittens, this one's speaking to you. Um, yeah, and, and please, please, please check it out. All the links are in the description. This is one off of the Foundation Point One Zero ETH here. Um, you know, just another example of how amazing this artist is. Um, still brings that fun. Love the pink colors of all of her new releases, bringing in that heart, bringing in that love. Uh, you know, this one has the musical vibe on it. So, of course, it spoke to Cardiac and I because, you know, we love that music vibe. Uh, so let's 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 turn it up for Arabella here. Uh, yeah, I mean, I love the pinks. I love the colors. I think for me, with with her particularly, it's the way it's the emotion that she can show on the faces of these of these artists that really do it for me. To be honest, uh, she, I, like a lot of her portraits, I just love them. Gazing off, I can see you know myself like just gazing off, listening to my favorite music. So thank you. This is beautiful. Hundred percent. I love this artwork. Uh, we're both music aficionados. We love to be around music. So anything tailored to that or implementing those type of vibes in it, which is the headphones in this one, is really something that is connecting to me. Love the colors in it. Love the purples. Love the fuchsias. Love the darkness on the outside. The pink in the middle. The purple blackish dress that this little female is wearing, along with the blue highlights around their underneath their eyebrows and I like the eyebrows that are purple actually and just like Moshe said I really love the expression of the face right uh, Arabelle is a real tenured artist uh, studied art so much so just to see her artwork you get so many elements and so much uh, depth of what she knows right so much love to that just got to give another thumbs up for this <laughs> because this is what's up I know even Jessica Alba is like, this is what's up, you know? So that's how you know it's a party. Um, every party, anytime Arabella's around, it feels like a party though. We honestly, we thank her so much. She is such a supporter. Uh, she is so, uh, so inspiring every day. Um, I mean, and her, just the way she fights for what she believes in um, is fun. And she don't take no shit from no one. And I appreciate that. Um, and I'm so blessed to have met her and, and she's a part of this beautiful community of acceptance and celebration that we're building. Um, and I love it, man. I love it. I, I, you know, this is one of my favorite parts of our show. Definitely uh, just love everything she's doing. Like I said, her artwork is great. She's pushing the space forward. Real badass artist. I know that interview that we're going to link to this is just real great. Goes in depth with 
her whole career, how she got started out. But we love everybody coming here, checking us out on NFT Art Talk. This is the artist studio where we just review all the great artists on NFT. We try to make the show super entertaining. So we just say it's the greatest artist show on YouTube that is entertaining in your face with great nostalgia and great art. So if y'all like what y'all see, subscribe, like that button down below comment below and also just follow us on all these socials because we have new material on all of them and once again we have so many videos from the artist studio to the dgen show we update news so please check out one of those videos and please come back and just come hang with us and learn about some nft stuff dgen out with us and learn about some great artists